Welcome to mechanical tutorial. I am going to teach you different techniques in SOLIDWORKS for mechanical engineers. I am going to train you different modules like surface modeling, sheet metal and enclosure design, product design, plastic components design, reverse engineering and many more tips and tricks in SOLIDWORKS. Hi, today I am going to explain about how to add design library in SOLIDWORKS. I am going to show you how to locate the path of the folder. See when we click here at the design library, here usually as a default the design library folder is visible see here or forming tool features and the smart components so you can see all these folders sometimes after installation this design library doesn't appear so for that what we have to do is we have to look at this folder so we have to select add file location and straight away it goes to the C folder here we have to select the folder program data here it's not visible so what we have to do is we have to go to C drive and view option we have to check these hidden items see here this program data is visible so when we look at this folder click this icon we can see this program data so we have to select this and further we have to go to SOLIDWORKS folder then we have to select latest version SOLIDWORKS so I have installed 2016 so if it is 17 or 18 we can select those folder and here we can see design library so we can see all the folders simply we have to say ok since my folder is located so I am cancelling this so this is the simplest way to locate the folder then we have to go to the options here we have to select file location then we have to select design library here we have to add the file location so we can simply paste this path since it is already located so i am deleting this so we have to after locating this folder we have to say ok now so we can have the access to design library folder so what is the advantage see if i go to forming tool i am selecting embossed tools so i have taken a simple flat sheet metal component so i am going to place this circular emboss 
So I'll flip the tool direction. See here. So even we can customize, like I have created examples. So we can customize and place this folder. And we can add the standard components or customize components in this folder. And it's easy to access. So, so this is how we have to add design library folder if it is missing. So I am going to once again explain about the path. We have to go to local C drive then we have to select the folder program data then we have to select SOLIDWORKS then SOLIDWORKS latest version and design library. Thanks for watching.